And now as far as wiring up of our GSM V4G, I have the system powered down and we're going on to the keypad bus. So what you're going to do is you're going to have on screw terminals 3, 4, 5, and 6, that's what's going to get connected to the panel. 3 and 4 are your positive, negative. 5 is your data in, so that's going to be your yellow. 6 is your data out, so that's going to be your green. So now we're all powered back up. All right, so again, on the GSM V4G, there's a little plastic cutout so that you can put your wire through when you're done. And when the cover snaps on, it won't pinch the wire. And we're going to wire it in. So right now what we're doing, you're going to need a four conductor and a two conductor. The four conductor, like we discussed earlier, red is positive. It's going to go on screw terminal number three. Green, I'm sorry, black is negative. So this is going to go on screw terminal four. Number five is your data out, so that's the yellow, which in our case we're using white. And then number six is going to be your data in, which is green. Okay, so now we have the bus powered in. The only other thing we need to do, uh, now this comes with its own battery, which we haven't put in yet, and it comes with a transformer. You can either, if you have enough outlet space, which they didn't, um, you can either just double up the transformer that they give you with the transformer that's already to the existing panel. Uh, what I'm going to do, or I already did, is I use the transformer that came with the communicator because it's a 40 amp as opposed to a 20 amp so it can handle a little more. So that's already wired up to my panel and what I'm going to do is I'm going to run a two conductor from where my AC goes into where my AC goes in the panel. So we're going to get the power that way. All right. This, um, this little bracket here comes with this little round plastic tab attached to it that you just take it right off. What that's for is up on the top, I don't know if you can see it, there's a little hole, okay? This just goes in here to cover it. That would be if you were using an external antenna, which we're not doing in this case. So that just seals it up. 